Hi, my awesome friends and family. We're going on a vacation, and I'm taking you along with us. This is the Vancouver Airport in Vancouver, Canada. A beautiful airport, as you can see. So beautifully decorated of all the beautiful sights of Canada. I really, really enjoyed this airport. One of the most beautiful airports I think I've been in. What do you think, my dear friends? And we're going to be taking a cruise from Vancouver, Canada, all the way down to San Diego on the Princess Cruise Line. It's a wonderful cruise line, and we got treated very well on the ship. And look at how big Vancouver is. We were in Vancouver probably like 35 years ago or whenever it was. We were there for the World's Fair, so we haven't been back since the World's Fair. And I could not believe how much this city has grown up. It is just beautiful. So many beautiful skyscrapers and such beautiful architecture and gardens on top of the buildings. But even there, as you can see in the far distance, they even have a homeless problem like we do. Not as bad. I only saw two different homeless areas the whole time we were in Vancouver, but even there they have it. But look at the architecture. Look at the trees on top of some of the buildings. Oh my gosh, it is a beautiful, beautiful city. We really enjoyed it. I wish we could have spent more time but as time goes, it always gets harder and harder to do the things we'd like to do. But at least I got to go one more time. Look at those trees. I can't believe them up in there. <coughs> We're also going to show um, the different boats moving around in the harbor moving people from one place to the other, as you're seeing coming up. And we had a lot of fun watching that, a lot of activity and seeing ships moving along in the harbor and seeing planes flying in. I really loved it. It was a beautiful harbor, and this is a beautiful city. If you've never been to Vancouver, I would say give it a try. I love Vancouver. When we went to the World's Fair in Ca Vancouver, Canada. It was just a beautiful place, a wonderful city, and we were renting a place from the bed and breakfast uh, about a block or two from the from the bay. It was just a wonderful trip with me and my children. So it was nice to go back and see all the changes. Uh, it looks like Vancouver has like doubled or tripled in size since we were there. Of course, it was a long time ago, but it's a gorgeous, gorgeous place to visit. So if you haven't been there, I think it's worth going and trying. Like I said, we went up there on, we flew up to go on this cruise. And it was a wonderful vacation. We'll be showing uh, some footage from this vacation uh, for the next week or so. So I hope you enjoy watching the footage. And my daughter took some of this footage, some of it I took. And that's why some of it you're going to see double and triple because we were both doing stuff. Here's my son-in-law next, standing next to the sign of the, the name of the boat, Sapphire Princess. And here is what it looks like on the inside. Isn't it a beautiful ship? It has that Egyptian theme in here. Um, we got treated really, really well on this ship. All the staff, I would give them an A+. Plus. The food was very, very good also. Uh, we took a tour, a cruise with Princess, I don't know, about 10 years ago to uh, Alaska. And I thought this particular uh ship and the staff was a little bit better and the food was better than it was even 10 years ago. This uh, 
employee was sharing with my daughter where we were supposed to have dinner at, where our seating was. And what I really liked about it, the dining room wasn't massive. They had multiple dining rooms. So I think we got better care because it wasn't quite so large. And here we are taking off. And we had a wonderful time looking at everything. I hope you're enjoying seeing this beautiful ship and everyone having an awesome good time. They had so many things to do and so much fun. As you can see, everybody's having an awesome good time. And the pool was great. And I probably should have took my swimsuit. I thought it would be too cold and we'd never be able to get in the water. And I was wrong. The weather was wonderful, even in Vancouver. We could have easily got in the water if I'd taken my swimsuit. But look at the bridge. Oh my gosh. It was just so much fun. So many things to see and enjoy. And look at how green the mountains are. We live in Southern California and you hardly ever see things as green as they are in Vancouver. And everyone was so excited about going off on this wonderful trip today. Well, it wasn't a day, it was a whole week. But as you can see, the excitement was in the air. Everybody was having a great time. I really, really enjoyed it. And it was even made better by having my husband along with me and my daughter and son-in-law. It's always great having fun with your family. Everything was just so beautiful. And we had such a great time seeing everything. It's amazing as big as this city was, that bridge wasn't too crowded. The traffic kept moving just fine. And even though this is a very, very busy port, it never seemed overcrowded and everything just seemed so well organized. I think this is one of my prettiest cruises. We've never cruised out of Vancouver before and I would love to maybe try it again. I would have loved to have went over to Vancouver Island, but my husband's health is not that good. And that is on my bucket list, maybe one day to get to sea. I don't know if I'll make it back or not at my age. But it's on my bucket list. There's always the chance that maybe it will happen. But look at how beautiful that blue sky was. And the weather wasn't cold and the weather wasn't hot. It was just perfect. I would have thought it would have been freezing cold, but I was pleasantly surprised the weather was just perfect. And look at how big this city is, all wrapped around the bay, and how beautiful everything is. We really enjoyed the food on the ship. Food was very, very good. We went and uh, ate in the smorgasbord or for breakfast every day and sometimes for lunch, but we always had dinner in the dining room. Me and my husband didn't leave the ship at all through the whole cruise. My husband's health is not that good. My daughter went ashore, so we'll be showing some video of different places that we stopped and she went to. Uh, there'll be all the footage from her part of the trip because we didn't leave um, the ship at all because like I said my husband's health but we still had a nice trip and um, I enjoyed the cruise a lot it was sort of restful even I the first night we were on the ship I I didn't I couldn't go to any of the shows at all because I was just so tired we just went to bed early after dinner and it took me about two days to get perky again I think and, but the great thing about going on a cruise, you can do as much as you want or as little as you want. If you just want to sit and watch the ship moving in the water, you can do that. Or you can join in in all the activities that they share. So I love going on cruises and we usually go, well we used to go every year. We hadn't been in about maybe four years. Uh, one year I had two surgeries and then my husband had brain surgery and then COVID hit and so then that really locked us down. 
And uh, COVID, I think, is pretty well over now. I'm not saying people don't get COVID, but the dangerous part of COVID, I think, is sort of past us now. Uh, so hopefully we will get to go on another cruise next year. Uh, we'll see how my husband's health holds out. That's really where I worry about. But as you can see, we just love going on cruises and everything always looks so beautiful. I think I'm just going to be quiet for a few minutes for you can enjoy all the beautiful scenery that my daughter and and I took of this area. It is just so, so beautiful. I always love Canada. And we used to travel. We, we've traveled up into Washington and Oregon before too. When my husband's health was better. I just so enjoy sharing our vacation with you. So get ready for a lot of footage of our vacation from Vancouver, Canada, to all the way to San Diego, California. And we're just sharing a little bit of footage of what some of the food looked like. This is just one of the soups that they served us. Very tasty. Everyone was very attentive in the dining room also. And this was just a wonderful place you could just sit and relax and visit with each other and there was never any pressure on anybody and that's what I loved about the cruise. It was just perfect amount of entertainment and just the perfect amount of things to do if you wanted to join in.